Happy Monday, everyone. Overall conditions a little bit more of the same. We did see some showers out towards the coast and as far inland as about Josephine County, almost the border with Jackson County. Now most of those showers are sticking out towards the coast and to the north and hopefully some more shower activity as the month goes on. But for the time being, it's looking like some dry conditions. Let's take a look at those headlines. A few light showers for the coast in Douglas County. The rest of us likely staying dry really for a good part of the week ahead. Dry inland with frost and fog and potentially freezing fog overnight tonight into tomorrow and likely again as we go Tuesday night into Wednesday morning. Dry, stable and cool week overall. Small chance for rain as we head into next week, but that chance seems to be getting smaller and smaller as we get closer to the middle of February. Air stagnation advisory may return as we get into about the middle of the week because of stable conditions. Otherwise for the coast, chance of showers that's mainly for Coos County. Further north you go, better potential you have of seeing some of those showers. Likely won't see much snow for higher elevations out there. It's just not that strong a shower activity, but some higher elevations, maybe a few flurries possible as you get up over the mountains. Clouds early tomorrow, then a slight chance of showers with partly sunny skies for most areas, especially further south by the afternoon. In the West Valley, so if you're looking for rainfall, it won't be much, but Douglas County, you do have a slight chance. Otherwise, patchy freezing fog tonight into tomorrow with temperatures for just about everybody below freezing. Some clouds to start out, some fog to start out, but sunnier by the afternoon. And east of the Cascades, mostly clear skies tonight. That means some pretty cold temperatures. But we're not warming up quite as much as what we saw this time last week under mostly sunny skies and some breezy winds, mainly out of the north. Those winds for the Rogue Valley eventually warming back up to those above average temperatures we saw over the last few weeks. That means possibly pushing 60 degrees towards about Sunday and Monday for the Klamath Basin. Cold mornings, warmer, or we'll call it more mild afternoons, but still pretty cool as we look at Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday before back to above average temperatures by Friday and Saturday. Northern California, also 40s in the afternoons, eventually 50s, possibly 60s as we go over the weekend. And out on the coast, slight chance of showers and some foggy conditions in the morning on Tuesday. Otherwise, mostly clear skies by the afternoon with temperatures topping out in the mid-50s.